Do you need sport sunglasses that work just as hard as you do? I'm Stephanie, and today we're checking out the seven best women's sport sunglasses of the year. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Steph from SporterX and I am going to go over the best women's sport sunglasses of the year. As you can see, I have a nice spread here on the table and there's something common about all these sport sunglasses that you want to look for in a good pair of sport frames. First and foremost, you want something that's going to be lightweight. It sounds like a given, but there's a lot of frames out there, metal frame materials, glass lens materials that are heavy and that will weigh you down. So you certainly want something that's going to be lightweight that you don't have to think about when you're wearing it on your face. The other thing is durability. You want to opt for materials that are impact resistant. Most sport frames already are impact resistant. Polycarbonate lenses are able to pack a punch or take a punch, if you will. Same thing with the frame materials. You want something that's going to protect you as well while you're out there getting after it. And the last thing, finally, you want grip. You want something that's going to stay in place on your face. You don't want to have to worry about adjusting your glasses when you're in the middle of your match or tournament or in your game. You want to be able to be at the top of your game and focus on what you're doing and not have to worry about adjusting your glasses. So let's get into it. First and foremost, we'll start with the Tifosi Wisp. We'll go from smallest to largest. So over here to my left, we have the Wisp and this is a very RXable frame. It is a super small frame. So if you have a small facial facial structure, the Wisp is a great frame for you. It's got an SFW measurement of 118, which translates to an extra small in women's. It's super lightweight, again, what you want in a sports frame. However, it is packed with sport features. So you have your rubber grip on your temples and you have your rubber grip on your nose pads. You also have some uh, rimless design, that semi-rimless design, so you get an unobstructed view at the bottom of the lens. So if you're in any kind of sport where you need to look down, softball, you're fielding grounders, golf, you're looking down and addressing the ball, a semi-rimless design is a great feature to look for in your sport frame. And you also get um, some hydrophilic capabilities with these uh, grippy materials here, meaning that it repels that dirt and oil and debris to help the, the grip just stick better to your face. So that is the Tifosi Wisp. Okay, next on our list, we have the Rudy Project Right On Slim. Now, Rudy Project does an amazing job of paying special close attention to the engineering in their frames. They do such a good job that we have probably the best nose pad that I've ever experienced personally. This nose pad is adjustable. Not only does it have that rubber grip to help keep it in place, it's adjustable. So if you need a frame that maybe you're, you have a flatter nose bridge or you have oftentimes you find yourself um, with the frame resting on your cheeks, and it just becomes a distraction because the frame rests on your cheeks or anytime you smile, you're lifting up your glasses and it's changing the optical alignment of your frames. This is a great option for you because that custom, super custom fit with that nose pad. The other thing it has is these straight back temples. If you are in a sport that requires a helmet or that requires a hat or a visor, um, you can easily take these frames on and off with this slim straight back temple profile and you're not getting caught on your hair and it's a nice kind of fit that's not interfering with any kind of headgear, headwear that you're that you're using. The other thing is that it's a prescriptionable frame. Um, this one has interchangeable lenses. So if you need multiple pairs of lenses to get you through different sport conditions, different game times, different tournament conditions, then you can get a lot out of one frame with multiple sets of lenses. The SFW measurement or the SporterX frame width on the Rudy Project Ride on Slim is a 130. That translates to a medium fit. However, if you do need a larger size, Rudy Project offers a larger frame. Rudy Project right on, just drop the slim. Um, and that one has a SFW measurement of 138. So that's a larger fit. And uh, yeah, you can't go wrong with the Rudy Project. I can't say enough about this frame. Great option if you need that adjustability and if you need something that's just right on. Next, we have the Tifosi Mira. This is another prescriptionable frame and it is also another semi-rimless design. A semi-rimless design is excellent, especially in sports where you need to look downward. So you get that unobstructed vision through the bottom. You're not getting a frame in your way. If you're in a sport like softball or in a sport like baseball, you need to look down and ground a field ball. Or if you are playing golf and you need to look downward and address that golf ball, you don't have a frame in your way as you're looking downward. Um, another great thing about this frame, similar to the ride on is it has adjustable nose pads. I get really excited anytime I see adjustable nose pads in a sport frame, because not only do you get grip, you get that adjustability. And those are two things that are just very unicorn 
features that aren't always often paired together in a sport frame. So another great option if you need that adjustability. In addition to that, you get that grip on the inside of the temples for some extra security when you're wearing it. In addition, you have some uh, ventilation there as well. So it's great to have ventilation in those temples because it helps minimize that moisture buildup from sweat out there. And it again, further helps with keeping that frame from slipping slipping around and slipping and sliding while you're trying to focus on the sport at hand. Um, the ventilation in the lenses is another nice feature that Tafosi put in here. The ventilation allows for a little bit more airflow across the surface of the lens. If you're in a sport that requires a lot of starting and stopping, you're creating a lot of body heat and then you're stopping and you, you have that cool down effect. What that's doing is creating a perfect storm for fogging. So if you're in a sport like that, uh, perhaps you're in a tennis or you're out there and you're doing a lot of sprinting and stopping like soccer, a great thing to have is some ventilation in those lenses so that you can help with that airflow going across the lens and helping combat that fog. The SFW measurement on the Tafosi Mira is a 131, and that translates to about a medium fit. Okay, in the center here, we got the native Kodiak. As you can see, it is the one full rim frame on the table here. The unique quality about the native Kodiak is that even though it's a full rim frame, it has interchangeable lenses. So that's very, very rare. If you need multiple lenses in the same frame to get you across different sport environments, different game times, different tournament settings, a native Kodiak is a good option for you. Um, the cool thing about the frame material in this, we talked about impact resistance. Not only is it impact resistance, it's made of Native's Rhino Tough Air, which is essentially their name for thermoplastic. So it can withstand extreme temperatures and maintain the integrity of the frame. And again, if you're in a contact kind of setting, um, it can take some impact as well. So super sturdy frame material. In addition, built into the frame, you have some ventilation there. So that again, just like the Tafosi Mira, it helps promote airflow across the surface of the lens to help combat fogging. Um, in addition, you get some grippiness here on the temples on the inside, as well as in the nose, the nose piece area. So this doesn't have those uh, prominent adjustable nose pads like the other frames that we previously looked at. However, you do get kind of that hidden sport feature here if you uh, just need a little bit of extra grippiness, but it's a little inconspicuous. So you can't really tell that it's in there. So that's a nice little hidden feature. Um, the native Kodiak has an SFW measurement of 133. So that translates to a large fit. All right, next we have the Maui Gym Sandy Beach. And apologies, I'm going out of order here. This one has an SFW measurement of 131. So that's about a smallish fit, small medium. And that's a little bit larger than the Kodiak, which is a 133. So Maui Gym Sandy Beach 131, extremely lightweight frame. This frame is super lightweight. You won't remember that you're even wearing it. It has that rimless, semi-rimless design. So again, great for sports where you need to look downward, unobstructed at the bottom there. You also have um, grippiness on the temple, um, the temples and the nose piece. So keeps it nice and in place, in your face, optically aligned, optically correct. Speaking of optics, Maui Jim's polarized plus two lens technology is in, in these Maui Jim frames. And Maui Jim's lens technology is unparalleled. So you are getting the best of the best in polarized lens technology with the Maui Jim frame. Know that if you're in a ball sport that requires you to do uh, track depth perception, say you're tracking a fly ball into your glove on a softball field, or you're on the golf course and you're trying to gauge the trajectory of the golf ball, know that polarized lenses can impact your depth perception. We typically advise against getting polarized lenses in sports that require you to utilize depth perception. However, it is all about personal preference. So know that you can order it at sportrx.com if it's not working out for you the way you want it to on the, on the field, on the golf course, in your sport, know that you have 45 days to ret return it. Free shipping, free exchanges, free remakes both ways. We got you covered. In addition, these frames are treated with saltwater safe treatment on the lenses and on the frame. So just like the name, the Maui Gym Sandy Beach, if you are in saltwater conditions, the lenses and the frames are treated so that it helps combat the corrosion that you might see with those types of elements. So great option, Maui Gym Sandy Beach, SFW 131, great small medium fit. All right, next we have the Nike Trainer. This is one of my personal favorites on the table here for sport. 
you get a very low profile, lightweight sport frame, but you get that full wrap eight base coverage. Eight base meaning it just wraps all the way around here to the sides to provide you with that protection through the periphery. Um, so especially in a ball sport like softball, if you're at the plate and need to see through the periphery, this is a great option for you. Or if you're on the tennis court and you are gauging balls from different directions, any eight base wraparound coverage is gonna be fantastic so that you're always viewing through the lens, no matter whether you're looking straight on or looking through your periphery. Um, so you get that eight base curve, you get the grippy nose pads in the middle here. What they call this is a floating nose pad. This is a quote, floating saddle bridge nose pad. And the cool thing about the floating uh, element to it is that you get a little bit of space between the frame and the nose pad. So if you do take some impact to the face, maybe you take a tennis ball to the face or a softball to the face, then you have a little bit more uh, give there that's gonna help absorb some of that impact. So a uh, great little extra feature. You also have some ventilated temple tips as well. So while it doesn't have grip on the temples, it does make up for some of that with the ventilated temple tips because it's helping to combat moisture buildup. So the less sweat buildup we have, the better grip, uh, grip function that we have. This is a 136 SFW measurement, so it's on the larger size. Um, you can, again, get this in prescription at sportrx.com. Last but not least, we have the Oakley EV0 blades. Now, unlike the rest of the frames on this table, this one is not RXable, but if you're wearing contacts out there, you do need a prescription contacts work for you. This is a great option to have over your contacts. So the cool thing about this is you get that full unobstructed view all the way around the frame. So not only do you have the rimless design at the bottom, you also have a rimless design at the top. I especially appreciate that for games where, or sports where you do need to look upward. So another game, softball, tennis is a great example of that where you're having to track balls upward, you're not getting any obstruction from the frame up here. Or if you're in a sport like cycling and you need to look downward and you need to um, see the road clearly without seeing this frame in the middle of your view. That's another great uh, application for this rimless all around frame. Oakley packs all their sport frames with all their amazing technology, one of those being unobtainium. So this is their patented grip technology, which is designed to get stickier and tackier the hotter and sweater that you get. So as you're getting after it and you're working hard, it's working harder for you and with you. So it helps just keep that frame securely in place and optically aligned on your face no matter how how uh, sweaty you're getting. Um, in addition, you're getting the Plutonite um, lens and frame material or the Plutonite shield, I'm sorry, the Plutonite shield, which gives you all of that great coverage. You're getting coverage, uh, huge field of view, but you're also having that impact resistant protection. So again, especially important in ball sports where you could potentially take impact to the face, you're getting protection with that Plutonite shield. Super lightweight, full rimless design, excellent for a big windshield field of view, unobstructed with unobtainium on that grip, SFW measurement 136, it's on the larger side. So great frame if you need big coverage and you need big fit. Well, that wraps it up for the best women's sports sunglasses of the year. Just to quickly recap everything on this table, uh, impact resistant, you get that full wrap coverage. You also have that nice lightweight, durable frame material, and you have that grip on the nose and or the temple tips to help keep those things in place and on your face. Remember, you can get them in prescription at sportrx.com. We have links to all these different frames in the description. We also have other great content on our blog and YouTube channel. If you need more information on lens lenses specifically for your sport or for specific sport recommendations or frame recommendations for your sport, we got you covered. Thank you so much for watching. We hope that we answered all your questions. Remember, leave them down in the comments if we missed anything. If you liked this video and it was helpful, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to ring that bell for more of our amazing content. You'll get alerts on all of the new stuff that we're publishing and we're also doing a lot of cool, fun stuff on social media. So follow our shenanigans below.